Peggy 18. Hi, Ghost. During the next couple of months, we are going to allow you, the fans, to ask us direct questions about Ghost Recon Future Soldier. We are going to give you a direct access to the team, both at Ubisoft Paris Studio and in Red Storm. You want a question answered? Please go to our Facebook page. For that first Ghost Q&A video, we go directly to Red Storm, where Evan Champlin and Ryan McCabe are going to tell you more about Ghost Recon Future Soldier multiplayer. Thanks and enjoy! What makes Ghost Recon Future Soldier multiplayer different from other games is, uh, first of all, on the level design set, we've designed our spaces around cover. We want cover to be extremely valuable to the player. We want them to use it for navigation with cover sweat. We want them to use it for protection. We want to use it as a shooting platform. So we really put a big emphasis on teamwork in our game, something that a lot of games, they just kind of do. We actually have what we call the coordination system in the game. And with this, you're able to communicate with your team without even using voice. You're able to point to objectives, say, hey, I'm going to go over to this one. I'm going to take this objective. So your team can then rally around you and you know follow you to the objective. If somebody's new in a map, they can use the coordination system as well to make a path in the world that's going to lead them right where they need to go. Another thing that uh, I personally really like in the game is the gunsmith feature. Just the amount of options that we give to players is incredible. The, um, having the ability to, to build a rifle that I actually use in real life is amazing. Teamwork again, really big. We have what we call the confidence system. If you go lone wolf, you know, you go up to an objective by yourself, you know, it's going to take you a lot longer to hack into that objective, you know, demo that objective, set up your explosives, whatever. If you have a teammate with you, you know, you're not, you're not constantly like darting around trying to see the enemies around you. You have, you know somebody has your back, so you're able to get that done really fast, make sure that it's ready to go, that you're good. Another thing I'm really excited about is the intel. Players have the ability to fly drones, throw sensors, uh, use place equipment, and um, my favorite aspect of it is the countermeasure side of it. The, um, there's something that I can do to counter every piece of intel in the game. 